Hey YouTubers, it's Rob Lovett. You guys have been wanting to do a video on the little Rossi 22 for a long time. Uh, I'm not an expert on guns. I've got three videos on YouTube. Uh, it's the little Taurus POI 22, the Heritage Arms 22, and ooh. <laughs> Carbine, I'm not going to open the box, but this is a little uh, high point 9mm carbine, very popular video, but I also made this case for it out of very inexpensive wood with a jigsaw. Anybody could do it. I made a video on it. You might want to check it out. But this is a video on the RS-22. I think it's going to be my last firearm video. Maybe I'll continue doing BB guns, but I'm not an expert. Uh, I'm just having fun. There's people on YouTube that have inhaled more burnt gunpowder than I shot. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm the lowest common denominator on YouTube when it comes to firearms, but I do a lot of research before I purchase a gun. And uh, th this is just my opinion. So, But I'm, I'm interested to hear what you guys have to say. These are the reasons I like the RS-22 and the reasons I don't. Spoiler alert, there's hardly any reasons I don't uh, like the gun. It's unloaded. It's... Uh, I have three magazines that come from Mossberg because they're cheaper, but the the magazine that comes with the Rossi has the little windows in there, the sight windows, so you can see what's inside your magazine, so I kind of like that better. This particular magazine has the little aluminum dummy round so I can cycle it. I cleaned it. I wanted to make sure it would cycle okay. And these are just little dummy rounds inside. It fits the Rossi magazine. It, I've seen nobody in any of the reviews I've, I've read has any problem with the magazine. And as you guys know, oftentimes the magazines can be the weak point of a particular firearm. The ones that come from the Mossberg company, which are practically identical, are quite a bit cheaper, but they don't have the sight window. But let's get back to the gun. The first reason I like the, the Rossi is because it's fun. It just reminds me of when I was a kid. I had Crossman BB guns and pellet rifles. I didn't grow up with firearms, but I did have BB guns and rifles. And this just, it's its not intimidating in the least. It's four pounds. If you were wanting to introduce someone into uh, firearms, I think, in my opinion, this is probably one of the best ways to go. Um, it, it just, it's just all around fun, lightweight. It's just, it, it's, it's a pleasure. It, uh, like I said, it's only four pounds. It has the the cross bolt safety, which is pretty standard. The trigger guard, the stock is made out of plastic. A lot of people don't like that, but I've had some plastic things that have lasted over 20, 30 years without any deterioration, even being out in the sun. They can manufacture plastic good if they want to. The actual way it looks, since the Mossberg Plinkster is, the the gun itself is identical except for the design features of, of the stock and so on. The Rossi looks better in my opinion. It has that very nice carved part here and the cheek part, it, it, it's really nice. It's covered up by the, uh, the uh, little things that I used to hold the magazines. By the way, this is a little... Uh, ammo carrier that's used for carrying shotgun shells and it's just the right size a little snug for using to carry the little uh, 22 magazines and i purchased it for just a few dollars on amazon also a few dollars i purchased a uh, sling i'm sure there's better slings out there but for my purposes it, it's perfect uh, it has the dovetail for putting on a scope it has a free-floating barrel, which a lot of people that are experts at that topic uh, say it's, it's a lot better for accuracy. It has the, the little, uh, what do you call it, the recessed crown, which is better for, for the accuracy. It has, which I liked, I'll never use, but I like, it has a threaded barrel. So it was $148.00 with the threaded barrel it was $140 without the threaded barrel. I said, 
we'll take two. So the bolt holes open on the last round. Um, the trigger is very light. It, it's a pleasure. Uh, you can you can lock in the the uh, the the charging handle uh, or the caulking lever. It depends on who you talk to. Rossi calls this the caulking lever, but some people say it's a charging handle. But caulking lever is fine. It had uh, a lot of accessories. You can you can purchase this. It's made by Mossberg. It's a folding stock that will fit on to the the uh, Rossi for like sixty. Was it sixty four dollars? I was going to add it. To this because it would be a lot smaller and looks kind of cool but once I put the magazines on the stock I kind of like this um, it also has uh, Mossberg makes a 25 round magazine however some people have had difficulty with the magazine so I didn't purchase it now let's look at the negatives the negatives are um, some people I because I, I read a couple hundred reviews there was a few people that said it didn't cycle, it didn't shoot the, the uh, ammo that they had, it and it jammed. But they never said if they cleaned the gun or not. But it could it could be they just got a bad one. But all, most of the reviews I read, that was not something that came up. I, I think I saw it twice. Somebody said it didn't shoot. Uh, it was kind of picky, they said. But I didn't see that in any other. I did, it was not a trend anywhere I saw the magazine is a little more expensive than the ones you can get from Mossberg. Um, it's not that easy to clean. It's, it's not it's not that hard. But I'm going to leave a link to a person that I watched his video. I watched several, and it was the best one I saw. And then in using to uh, clean or take apart, not clean the uh, the, the, the the Rossberg the Rossberg the Rossi. Uh, uh, that's funny. Um, the biggest beef I have about the Rossi is that it used to be $89 or $99. In some cases, the gun stores would give you a Rossi if you bought another firearm. Now they're $140, $150. So that's my biggest complaint. Um, I would buy another. I have bought another. Just because I don't know if you can always get something with a threaded barrel that's this much fun for $148. Um, so it's it's a hoot. It's 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 a joy. I I I don't I can't think of any really strong negatives. Uh, there's it's for the price. If I think if you were to charge a lot more then I would start finding things to nitpick but but for the price even at 148 with a threaded barrel um, it's, it's, a. Uh, I would buy it again and I did. <laughs> so that's my review for the, for the Rossi. I hope you guys, uh, enjoyed it and you come back. I put new videos on every single week, but doing over 14 years, got over a thousand videos. I have a playlist of gun videos. That's mostly BB guns and pellet guns and pellet rifles, but I have some firearms in there too. You might be interested in. So guys, hope this was something you enjoyed. And if you have any comments, please leave them and I'll respond. And it's, it's always a, an asset when people leave information about things and they watch the video so other people can learn, including the person who made the video. So, all right, guys, hope you uh, liked it. I, I said that already. All right, I'm rambling. All right, take care. See you out there.